We picked this one up with Dave Steam on the mound for the Jays. He's coming off a one hitter, but he would give up a lot of hits in this one. The Royals strike for six in the first. Gruber starts the Jay comeback, though. This is a solo shot in the bottom of the first, his third of the year. Then it's Kelly Gruber again. With the score seven to two, Kansas City. Steve Long gone in the second. This two-run double brings in Manny Lee and Tom Wallace. The Jays close to seven to six after two. It was a shootout. Then in the fourth, Bo Jackson will step up to the plate. Wells deals, and who says George Bell can't play left field? Look at that lunging grab. The Jays still hanging close. And then Jesse Barfield letting everybody know that he is back. His wrist is better, and he is turning on those fastballs. Barfield puts the Jays up 9-7 to seven with a three-run shot. Then seventh inning, Gruber again. A shot to the gap. Willie Wilson on his horse. He can't get to it in time. Smashes into the fence. And then it's Wallace and Mosby coming in to score for Toronto. Two more runs. It's 11-8. to eight. Then Gruber comes up in the ninth. It was a Gruber clinic. Watch this. A chance to hit for the cycle. A bleeder, a dying quail just falls in. Gruber drops the single into left center in front of the Jim Eisenreich. The Jays go on to win this game 14-8. Gruber with yesterday.